I'm bored, you're bored. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits? Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Kid, are you alright? Uh, you, I, I tried to, yeah, I told you to stay back, but what surprises me more, look at your hand, huh? As Zuku's looking, he sees sparks of electricity start to flow throughout him, he's like, I have a quirk? Uh, no. And yes. I, I don't really know. This is... Come with me. Wait, what? As yes, this is when Cole is pretty much... Okay, hey, recovery go. Cole, what are you doing here? Why is this kid here? I need you to look into something. Look. Look at him. Zuku, he's starting to mess with the electricity. It's, uh, don't tell me he's a conduit. I don't know what he is. But watch this. Him just spilling water on Izuku. And Izuku's fine. Why is you? Oh, it wasn't to be a jerk or anything. Hold on. Uh, stand back. Um, as soon as Cole steps into it, he gets jolted back. So, uh, wait, you can't. I can't go in water. Or at least. War has is too saturated and whatnot. And then not all the water is technically fresh in the pool. Uh, wait, so I can this mic work? Recovery girls looking at this is a What's your name, kid? Izukumidoria. Okay, <clears throat> Izuku. You asking if this is your quirk? Does that mean you? I was diagnosed quirkless. Really? Hmm. Step into this machine. What? It's just gonna take a quick sample. It'll be painless. I promise. What her doing is, is a well, this is an interesting turn of events. What are you talking about? It seems as though this kid has the conduit gene. How is that possible? I I'm not finished. It also seems he does have the quirk gene, but it's a weird mix mash. From what I can gather from our years of research, it seems as though he's a blank until you decide to come in contact with him. A blank? What? What? What, what are you talking about? You see, when it comes to conduits. Their powers can vary and be completely at random. Have nothing to do with their family or, you know. When it comes to quirks, it's usually, you could say, not a mix mash or, or a complete and utter randomness. It's usually genetic. For some reason, this kid has a... Interesting combination. 
in which his, he doesn't have a quarter to activate, that slot's blank. And so is uh, the whole uh, slot that we did take his conduit abilities. So, yeah, he's a blank. Well, at least he was. What? So, when he... Yep. He absorbed your ability. And now that is what fills the slot. So... He does have a quirk, technically a quirk now. The only thing is, luckily he can't get any more, from what I can see. Unless there's something traumatic that happens that causes him to lose it. But the odds of that are slim to none. If at all. You think you're trying to get a pretty much a good uh like wait you what are you trying to say you have a quirk now only thing is it's uh power similar to his i say similar because unlike him you can go into water and possibly do more with it than he could What could he do? Well, believe me, his life wasn't always easy upon receiving these abilities. How did he get his powers? A grand explosion that wiped out so many people and caused terrible things to occur. For what I can tell, he's the only conduit and you are the first I've met that has both genetic markers. It's extraordinary, but also begs the question, does anyone else have this ability? Hmm. I wonder. We're going to do some more research on this. Oh, we can just keep him here. Why not? Is it? You kidnapped him, didn't you? <laughs> no, 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 no. I just told. I decided to bring him with me so you can study him and hopefully he doesn't fry anyone he knows and loves. What? Oh. Oh, I should have said that. No. Especially to a child. Are you crazy? Don't worry, dear. You are not going to kill anyone. Uh, unless you want to. But if anything... Cole, if you would. Uh, uh, oh, right, right, uh. <coughs> if, uh, you need any help, you are more than welcome to ask. I will try to assist you, uh, no. What? But I thought, oh no, you are training this boy. Okay. What? Yes. You are training him. I am not going to let you just give him these abilities and not train him. That is very irresponsible. But I, I'm not good with kids. Well, you better learn. This is your fault. I want to hear it. Is it good? He's happy that he has a query? But it's like, is it really that dangerous in his mind? Believe me, the explosion that caused him to get his powers was catastrophic. Uh, oh. Huh.
So, is there anything else I need to know? Hmm. Technically, no, but... At least not yet. Huh. It's very interesting. So, kid, um, did you have any plans for the future? Uh, well, until I was diagnosed Quirkless, I wanted to be a hero. Oh, that's, that's a very admirable huh, want. That, that's very interesting. Yeah, you had to train this kid or else he's going to fry people by accident. But <clears throat> how, where should I start? First, build up his muscle, because he is a kid, after all, but the only thing is... Uh, Alright. Hmm. Alright, okay, good, good, I can, I can do that, yeah. As, yes, he hit by Digup a Beach, and... This is where Ziku's uh, training begins. Only thing is, there's something a little off here. But Cole, he's not good with kids. He's not good with really interacting with people, especially considering his uh, distrust in some and others. But because he's a guy, he's easy to talk to. He's someone that he's, you know, he's a genuinely nice person. Yeah, well, it's it's easy to so why not? First things first, build up more muscle. He's a kid, so it's, he doesn't be too strenuous on him. It's enough so he does pack on some of it, just. Not so much that you think he was a major Hercules. Next, he learns parkour and free running. Only thing is, though he would like for Izuku to get a job in which he needs to be fast, uh, he's too young to get one. So what does he do? He just gives him, he's like, okay. I'm just going to make this little obstacle course for you out of all this junk. And hopefully that will help you get more in tuned to your... Hmm, to your uh, new abilities. What do you mean? Well, we have being electricity. You can actually use it to supercharge yourself. I'm surprised you haven't used it in your huh, weight training. Uh, after hearing that I could possibly fry someone I love and care about, I want to refrain from using it. That is very responsible of you. But still, you have to use it sometime. You want to be a hero, right? Yeah. Okay, try using it. Just feel the electricity just flow through you, making it so you feel like it's part of you. Make sure it flows throughout your whole body. You feel it in your being, and yeah, it's a very strong feeling. It's, hmm, how should I put this? Like you are that you say you are a lightning bolt, you could say. As is you he tries to understand what he's saying, it was like, okay, so pretty much treat the power as just a part of me. That's right. I wish you could have just said that. Uh, mm. Okay. Just just insulting my teaching skills. The, the, the perfectly fine. Either way, let's go. 
So when it comes to coal, he uses it to demonstrate. Yeah, I'm actually speeding himself up and supercharging his legs. And you could say it's kind of like using uh, Luffy's second gear, only with electricity. He's faster, he's almost to a point where Isu can't even see him. Which, like, I can do that? If you train enough, maybe. So, him trusting Cole as much as he can is like, okay, focus. Let the electricity flow through me. As he just goes off and to the point where he smashes into a concrete wall and drink himself. Cole being terrified, thinking, oh my god, that he just splattered all over the place. Like, he calls it a crater in the wall. As he's just like, okay, he not, okay, you gotta heal. Where where's the nearest power source says he's looking. He sees Izuku is Healing on his own? Wait, what? Wait, how are you? Oh, that's right. Him, he's starting to use his electro sense in which he's, he's trying to see how much he, juice Isuku actually has. He's actually easier to do it. He, Using on Izuku, considering that, yeah, they had the same abilities. But what you see is actually Izuku is charging himself, like that annoying bar on the top of the screen that just shows you how much juice you have left before you have to recharge. Izuku is recharging himself. Again, he's like, how is this possible until he realizes Izuku had technically two blank slates when it came to the quirk and the conduit gene. They merged to create a new type in which one carries all the power he needs, the other one allows him to use the abilities. It's like his quirk gene, or at least Conway Jean or is acting like the battery. Well, either one could be the way to use it. Huh, but that begs a question: Can he absorb more? And if he can, how much can he absorb? At least right now. So if anything, he goes to a building. Just a regular building. Let's say it's a grocery store. It's a, it's a small one. Hey. Alright, absorb the electricity. What? Him demonstrating is. Oh. Let me try. Like, duh, duh. As soon as Izuku does it, he absorbs all of it by accident. The whole place goes dark. Everyone's screaming. He's wondering what's going on. Him and Izuku just running like, oh my god, I can't believe you did that. Like, I didn't mean to. Should I give it back? He's like, wait, don't. Which causes the Transformer to just be destroyed and all the light bulbs and whatnot blow up, especially any electronics within the vicinity. Izuku's like, so that's what she meant. Like, yeah, you gotta be careful. But luckily, uh, hopefully, no one saw that. Hmm. But this kid, he's something else. As, yes, this is where Izuku is around 10 years old. He sees his... Okay. So, what's my lesson now? Well, you pretty much aced the obstacle course I laid out for you. So now it's time for the real thing. Buildings and walls and whatnot. What? Oh, yes. 
First things first, scale this building. Huh? You heard me. But I, I just don't be scared. I promise. If anything happens, I'll fix it. Are you sure? Just do it. Izuku just looking out how high it is. Let's, let's say it's three, four stories. Go, look, come on, just do it. I'll catch you if you fall. I could fall? It's like, Duh. Of course you could fall. It's, I mean, of course not. As long as you stay focused and remember your training. No, you won't fall. The curry girls there is saying, Wow, you're so you're so great with kids. You know that, right? Yeah. Either way. <laughs> so, uh Well if I look down, don't. As Izuku starts climbing, he's looking for any notches or anything, he can just put his Thing and it's terrifying for him. He's like, Don't worry, you're doing great. Him mistakenly looking down, he's like, Really? Oh, 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 no, no, no. Him losing his grip. Cole about to, to jump up and catch him, but then he stops. He's like, But you caught me. No, no, I didn't. Izuku looks and he sees electric claws digging into the stone walls, the side of the building. He's. Whoa. Kid, what did you do? It's like, I just. Him just sh dropping. It's a, I didn't want to fall, so I envisioned something to grabbed me, but I didn't think this would happen. <laughs> Kid, you... That's amazing. But just then, a villain fight occurs, in which Izuku, he feels confident that he's strong enough to at least protect himself, and possibly will be able to help. So he runs out Thanks to Cole's confidence building training. Only thing is, Cole is like, are you an idiot? And runs after him. Even recovery goes. <sighs> Why? Why do I surround myself with stupid people? They're just following both of them. Which, yes, it is the Almighty versus all for one fight. Izuku excited over seeing this. He's thinking, wow, I can't believe I'm so lucky to actually witness one of All Might's hero fights live in person like this. But do you gotta realize like, this is a very dangerous, yeah, I mean, problematic situation he finds himself in because if the villain sees him it could be hell on earth if all my sees him and starts prioritizing his safety it could end up in all my getting hurt badly so he tries his best to stay as completely unnoticeable as possible. When Cole shows up on the scene, he sees Izuku hiding. He's like, what are you doing here? Like, I, I, I just got excited and I, um, I, let's just go before anything else happens. Has any of this is, uh, wait, what was that? He feels something familiar as he looks right behind it all for one and he sees there's no way now. What? <clears throat> Nothing. Uh stay here. I I'll uh I'll be right back. 
wait, what, what, what's going on? It's like, nothing. Don't worry about it. By the time the recovery girl gets there, she starts scolding you. She's like, where's Cole? It's like, I don't know. He just left and said he'd be right back. I need to start surrounding myself with smarter people. It'll be the death of them and me. And she's pretty much looking. She's seen the awful one versus all my fight. And she sees that all my is pretty much he's starting to run on empty when it comes to the energy. So, okay, you stay here. I am might be needed. She just has these pro. <laughs> Tina energy drinks is ready. Uh, she, she's coming with the whole, you can say, sensu bean package without the sensu beans. Just ready to heal. As soon as all my Caesar is like, wait, what are you doing here? Wait, how'd you know? It's like, don't worry about it. If anything, I'm here to help, and you are going to accept that help regardless. Touche. What's that? It's like, here. Oh, what's this? A little. Ooh, that's good. Ooh, that's good. Good. I've been working on it. In a way, her kissing him and Izuku, he, though he's seen her girl heal, to him it's still embarrassing. He's a kid. He's It's weird for him. He doesn't really see why I'm in like that, especially someone as old as a cover girl. <laughs> So, All Might actually does get some uh, unexpected assistance. Well, for one, it's pretty much like, it doesn't matter how hard you fight me, I've already won. Him turning behind him and saying, wait, where is it? This is when Cole shows up. Okay, Izuku, now we can go. Wait, what's recovery you all doing there? Oh, I, um, you see, she, she decided to go help All Might because he seemed like he was, uh, getting a little fatigued and it's like, you know what, <clears throat> whatever, whatever, I, I don't care. Let's just go now, please. And yeah, that's pretty much how that goes. That's that's how it ends, at the very least. <laughs> He's a go. <laughs> And Cole just leave for Cover Girl and All My Tiddly double team all for one, which does actually result in his capture. But one thing about All My is what was he looking behind himself for? What was he trying to. Hmm. Interesting. As yes, this is when Off One does get to see Sir and I. He's completely restrained to the best of their ability. He even as I was there just to make sure he has the dead eyed stare, can't use the quirk. So as soon as Nai looks into his future, he's We gotta go. What what's wrong? It's like, no, we we are leaving. We have to go to this address. What? Wait, why? He sees Alpha One and Alpha One is calm. But even as I can see, there's a bead of sweat. He still has his face. Only thing is, he's like, uh, his poker face is failing him. At least his sweat is. Failing him and his nervousness. Them going to the address and they find the doctor, but as he was leaving, so he gets away. But one thing that they do find is actually Shigaraki or Tenko Shimura. All my, he's been known for. Quite a while by now, so as soon as he's like, uh, "What's your name?" Tenko, Tenko Shimura. He's like, "You're my master's kid." Wait, 
What? You know Nana Shimura? She trained me. My grandma? As yes, Shigaraki feeling as though he's been saved by an actual hero. Because before, when it comes to Alpha One, Alpha One was his hero. But even he saw the malice, the pure, pure lack of human sympathy or empathy, whatever you want to call it. So, if anything, yeah, he was. Uh, this is the early stages of his potential brainwashing, which is why Alpha One was so nervous. This being so, that's how you've been leaving, living all this time. I just wait was waiting for a hero to come save me. <laughs> no one came. Whatever people will walk away seeing me like that, just said, "Oh, a hero will take care of it," and I still waited. All my seeing this, hearing his story, how his father hated heroes and punished him for loving them so much, having so much faith, this angered All Might a lot. Heck, he, he would have arrested his father if he hadn't already uh, just departed from the world. And you can just imagine, he's like, there's no need to fear, because I am here. As Shigaraki's eyes, Tenko's eyes, they start having hope for heroes again. Not as much as before, but I'm sorry it took me so long, but I'm here for you. Is yes, he's carrying Tenko out of off of one's little safe house, and that is how it ends. When it comes to Izuku's training, yeah, he's he's focusing on uh, using those claws again, even taking off his shoes and socks. Is like, what are you doing? Like, I'm on time. Make this feel better. I'm going to try to make utilize this a lot more. Okay. Interesting. Okay, very well. Let's see what you got. Izuku, he starts with a aura of electricity. Be more of a shield. Suzuko cool, starts to see how much power he has left in the tank. He's like, oh, I see what he's doing. This way, he doesn't use too much energy, as well as it being used as a shield. Him just throwing a rock, it gets vaporized. So, that's incredible. This kid is a prodigy, from what I can tell. So... Yes, Izuku is learning how to utilize his powers. And Cole is recovery girl like you are a fast learner. <laughs> no, I just have good teachers. And you are too pure. What the hell, man? Seriously. Um Thanks. But I, I'm not that pure. I'm just uh, too nice. Okay, seriously. Who? <sighs> you can go home now. You can go back home. Uh, training's done for today. Which, yes, Yuko has been told about Izuku's quirk awakening. And so has Bakugo and his goons and the school. They just... Bakugo just sees this as like... Well, he's not that... 
he just got his quirk. He can't be that good at using it, so it's, uh, it's nothing to worry about, is there? Yeah, of course. The quirk nerd who loves researching quirks and how they, the downsides, the capabilities work. Yeah, as soon as he gets power, he is. There's nothing to worry about. Now, let's get to 11-year-old Izuku, in which, since, yeah, he has had some time to really think about how to use this quirk slash conway ability, he's gotten better at absorbing as well as distributing electricity. And... Though he can't really get a job, he does do some quick money grabs to which he does get paid. And since he doesn't really want anything else and all that All Might memorabilia, he does still like All Might, but he he can see that it's kind of a excessive. So he does get rid of at least uh three-fourths of it. He still has some posters and figurines. That's pretty much it. No no comforter, bed covers, whatnot. No. He, he, he knows this a little much now. <laughs> when it comes to All Might and Tenko, he's training with Tenko to at least control his quirk. Even giving him some special gloves in which, technically, not all five fingers are touching something. Making him feel more normal, less dangerous. He regrets everything and the fact that he still has the the hands of his family it shows that yes, he he is not gonna forget what he did. He feels terrible for what he did. Heck, he has the paw of his dog. One of the things that made life so much more bearable on the thumb of his father. Yeah, he has not had an easy life. It is not fair to him at all. But then, is it good with these? Him being 12 now, we'll have a little time to get where he's 12. He's, he feels like something, there's something that they are not telling him. Though they do give him some more information about how conduits became a thing. He still wants to know, like, how, how is it that he has technically a merged version of the Conduit gene and the quirk gene. How is that possible? So, you might as well tell him now. <sighs> okay. Right about the time conduits became more of a normal occurrence. People started to worry about them. How so? Let's just say the conduit gene is actually the a more of a blueprint for what society is now. What? The conduit gene is the court gene in its beginning stage uh, what <sighs> once Conway started to become more mainstream and people started to get more used to them there are still those who were worried about what they the capabilities of someone like with Cole's powers or so like say someone had smoke or magma concrete you get what I'm saying those are some very dangerous powers so 
some scientists got together, started capturing some rogue conduits, and years later, the first quark came to be. And that is, as you would say, is ancient history. What? Are you saying that technically everyone who's quirkless is a conduit? The only thing is, they got a more genetic version. Something more controllable. <laughs>